up everybody it's your girl Yanni and I'm back with another video and I feel like y'all been waiting up for me to do this video for a minute now so I'm finally doing it I am doing an updated review on the Calpax tote bag the Haven tote bag I told y'all I got mine in black as y'all saw in the last video when I first got the bag I made that video but I had already had the bag it just took me a while to get it uploaded and everything so now I've had this bag for a little bit over a year so one year review of the bag but if you're not already subscribed go ahead and subscribe to your girl and let's uh, let's talk about this bag y'all like I said I've had this bag for a little bit over a year um, I don't remember the exact date I'm sure it's in my email since I ordered it online but I made a list of pros and cons about this bag and since I've had it for a while now. So I felt like that was the smartest way to go about doing this review. So first I'm gonna talk about the pros with you guys, which some of the pros were that I like the amount of space that this bag has. And I like all the pockets. I'm gonna take this laptop part out for you guys again, just to kind of remind you. I still utilize this space, but I took a lot of things out of this bag because I was just carrying around too much. So right now it has my laptop, my agenda, and the chargers and just little stuff that I use. But with it being like this, that means I can still put my cup in there. I know that was a question that you guys had a long time ago or when I did that video. Um, the cup does fit in here and then I'll put it back in the bag so you guys can see it. It's not hanging out or anything. You can see this little bulge, but I mean, it's not like a big bulge and this doesn't feel heavy. So if I wanted to just have it on now and I can have it like this or if I wanted to use the strap, I know that was another question. Let me show y'all if I can move this out of the way. Then this is actually how long it goes down. And this is my side. I am five, eight and a half. So I'm pretty tall, but this is how far it comes down. And then I know some of those pictures on the website show it over. And this is about how far it comes down to when you wear it over. So yeah i'll talk about the length of this strap and all that in a little bit later but i know that that cup question kept coming up and let me see what size cup is this so this is a 24 ounce cup that i put in there if you have something bigger i mean it'll probably still fit in there it probably won't fit in the pocket like i just put it in there but it'll probably still fit so another thing was uh, it's really easy to clean and just take this part out and then if i need to clean it then i'll just like kind of tip it over and dump everything out plus if you want to take everything out of here just throw this in the washing machine i wouldn't put it in the dryer just doesn't seem like a good idea to me i don't know but i wouldn't put it in the dryer let it air dry and then you should be good to go it'll smell good yeah if you have like if you put makeup in here or something it should come out after you put it in the washing machine it's still pretty much in good shape i, mean, I wouldn't say it looks exactly new i just got the spot on here probably could have wiped that off but even that you can just take a wipe and get that off so it's still easy to clean it goes with that point but yeah the bag still looks good like uh, I don't want to this bag off. But yeah, the bag still looks really good and conditioned for me to have had it for over a year now. I saw people in the comments last time were getting different colors, which is great for you. So somebody said that they got pink. That's awesome. All of the colors are really cute, but I did get black because it does go with everything. So even the outfit that I got on right now, like still not super dressy. You could dress it up if you wanted to, but if you just are going to the grocery store you know target that's where i go but <laughs> you can still take it and it still looks fine it doesn't look weird or anything and i do take this bag everywhere so it probably should be a lot more beat up than it is but it's not so one of the pros it'll last you i work at a school so i do have to use like my laptop and have like i don't know writing utensils and Sometimes a notebook here and there. I'll put a book in the bag sometimes. Like it still carries everything pretty nicely. If you put a lot of stuff in there, it's gonna be heavy. Or, I mean, that's just what it is. So then that bigger strap will come in handy for that. The pockets did not overstretch or anything. And I've, I've put quite a few things in the pocket. You just saw I just put my cup in the pocket and I've done that often especially going to work it doesn't have any effect it didn't stretch them out or anything so that's really good also another pro is that it has a one-year warranty on the bag so as long as you have that warranty and you can see like if you have any problems with the bag within that year 
then you can go ahead, email them. They have um, a place to go on their website that's pretty easy to get to. You go there and they should replace the bag for you or fix whatever the problem is that you're having. They should do that. So that's all with the good things. That's a lot of pros, I feel like. So let's get to the cons, right? Because I know that's what y'all here for, for real, for real. The cons of this bag. First thing first, which a lot of you guys are asking me again, this strap is shorter than most people would like it to be, even though it doesn't look like it, but I think people want to have it like sideways and that's probably why it's short. Like I wouldn't want it to come down to my knees or anything, but like, I don't know. I don't know if you have a lot of stuff. I don't know if, if you want to wear it different ways. I feel like it would, should be a little bit, just a little bit longer. So for me, having it where I did, I have it on like the longest adjustment possible. I never use the shorter ones because I don't like it like that. But yeah, it could have been a little bit longer. So I will say that. Okay, I'm gonna zoom in on this, but maybe y'all can see. There's like a couple of threads and I don't really remember what this material is, but it started peeling from using this part a lot. Um, I just feel like for the price, it should not peel because it shouldn't, I don't know. I feel like this part should have lasted a little bit longer because I mainly have the bag by this bigger strap and I don't use these all the time. I feel like it shouldn't have really been peeling, but I mean, it is what it is. It's normal wear and tear, I guess. I just feel like it probably could have lasted a little bit longer. However, I mean, you can't really see that if you're not like paying close attention to my bag so we'll say that also this strap here broke so it's supposed to have two adjustment things so one is supposed to be here and one is supposed to be here the one that's here is still here and it screws in the back however this one came a loose and yeah i'm just not happy about it because when i carry the bag around now for a long time sometimes it'll just kind of unhook itself so I did email them about that and I'm just kind of waiting for the response to see if they're going to give me a new strap or a new bag or whatever. So I'll make another video letting you guys know what happened with that and how the service was with that. Um, and I'll get back with you to see how that got fixed. Also, the one year warranty, I feel like again with the price of this bag, they do offer two year warranties on like their other bags. Some have one year, some have two year, but I feel like with this bag it just should have been two years it, that could just be my personal opinion but i feel like two years would really help you discover like the conditions of the bag everybody's not going to use it every day and this would just give you more of a chance to be able to use it but like i said it's been a little over a year and this just happened so i would really be upset kind of if they don't give me a new strap just because I don't have to pay that money again versus if you would have had like a case bait or coach or whatever then i feel like that wouldn't really happen you know it is what it is i do love this bag honestly i love love love, love, love this bag i love everything about it apart from those little things apart from even the strap i mostly don't even care because like i just showed you like it's short her than I would have preferred it to be but it's still enough length that it doesn't really bother me and I can still fit my cup in here which I love to have my cup of water coffee whatever it is that I have in my cup I like to have that my smoothie cup I'll put that in here as well um, I do love that I do love all the pros that come with it the fact that you can wear that strap two different ways yeah this is just my baby i literally take this wherever and it just doesn't look bad i've got compliments on the bag so i think it's really good also i didn't even put this in the freaking pros hold on let me get my bag out there i never showed y'all hold on let me fix my camera i never showed y'all it on my luggage in the first review that i did so here's my luggage this is my big one okay. maybe i should show you on my smaller one the strap actually goes on there and i don't have this is such a luxury i thought i was not going to be traveling as much when i got the bag because i kind of had stopped but i figured okay what if you do have to travel i know i hate having to carry this bag through the airport so it just goes if you have a carry-on and you got this bag it's just going to attach it doesn't move around it's like perfect if you have to slide it like it's fine if this is 
you have to slide it like so freaking perfect and it goes on there with no problems then when you're ready or if you take this to get checked in slide it off carry your little bag and be on your way so i really like that feature i don't, I don't know it just feels so good to not have to carry anything i don't like carrying things through the airport in general so this was really helpful for me but i did just kind of want to show you guys that yeah those are the pros and cons for the bag i like it for the most part for me since it has more pros and then cons for me um i can kind of get over the length of the strap and get over the wear and tear on those two little straps that i don't really use that much it's just not a big deal but i really 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 like the bag so i'm gonna update you guys on what they say about the strap hopefully they send me a new strap that your girl be back in action because i know that'll be really annoying for me let me know if you guys like this video if you guys have any questions feel free to drop them in the comment section i feel like i was pretty good about getting back to people in a timely manner last time so if you have any questions about this bag then let me know in the comments other than that if you're not already subscribed make sure you subscribe to your girl thank you for watching as always i appreciate you guys so 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 much and i'll see you guys in the next video okay bye